Tonight we're going to be doing a small image demonstration of the Bay Oasis UTMX, showing that even though this thing is almost 10 years old, it still has one hell of an image. Dog right here. Go through the color palettes. Um, black hot first. Black Agitech now. White hot. Now, since we have a thermal target here, I'm going to demonstrate one feature of this that to me is kind of unmatched. Oh, there they go. We'll focus out the right here. We'll demonstrate a feature on this that's virtually unmatched with any thermal I played with, including the Voodoo M, Voodoo S, Skeet, any thermal I played with. This unit has by far the best digital zoom I've ever seen on a thermal. Look at that. There's essentially no image degradation. So whenever you're digitally zooming in to the core, you should be cutting the resolution in half. As you can tell, it doesn't look like that. Look a little bit further now. Do the same thing. That digital magnification is absolutely pristine. Focused on the truck. And I'll do the same thing. Just fantastic. Everything maintains a very smooth and detailed image. Unlike every single other malware uncooled thermal I've ever played with. See all the detail on this tree and the leaves. Very aesthetically pleasing. Now the display color in this is not as blue as you're seeing in the video. But it is as blue to your eye because I'm using this with SureShot Night Vision's SNR filter. Which is primarily for PBS 14's or I squared night vision. But it works very well with thermal just to help smooth out the image. Change it to a cooler hue. The hue on this one's more of a greenish yellow. But with this filter, it makes it look like a high foam white phosphor tube. A night vision tube and not thermal. And then we'll just pan around. A little bit in edge detect. I'm going to go to white hot. The color palette most people associate thermal with. I primarily don't use white hot, but that's just kind of my preference. It does have its uses, but I'm more of a black heart, a black hot sort of lad. And we'll do the same digital zoom function with white hot. It's fantastic. Amazing digital zoom capability. And black hot. Again, which is what I prefer. Right, now we'll change up our area.
This is probably about 700 yards away, top of that tower. Angle of focus, let's really crisp up the image. This right here from my position is about 240 yards away. Digitally zoom. I said by far best digital zoom that I've ever seen on a thermal. There's essentially no image degradation. If you play with thermal, you know how impressive that is. I'll be doing a full review of this versus the Pixels on Target Voodoo S, which essentially is an upgraded version of this with about 8 to 10 years newer technology. But, is it 8 to 10 years better? I think everyone will be quite surprised. Hope you enjoyed the little demonstration. I'll be bringing it back with that comparison here very soon. Thanks.